In Creo Parametric 10.0, the spine tool in Warp has been enhanced, allowing you to select a target reference curve to modify your model. In previous releases, the spine tool allowed you to pick the curve along the geometry to be modified and manipulate it manually by pulling and pushing points along the spine curve. However, this process was tedious and not very precise. With this new enhancement, you can now easily modify your model by selecting a target reference curve to map the spine curve to. In this example, I'll select the spine curve I would like to modify. Using the target pull-down menu, you can now choose by reference. Selecting the new reference curve, you'll immediately see the geometry modify and map to the selected target curve. Selecting the spine tool again, I could do the same operation for another target reference curve. Completing the warp feature, you can now edit the target curve definition to modify the curve shape. In this case, I'll edit the curve in the style feature. Adding a point, I can now move it to the appropriate location, updating the curve. Once finished modifying the curve, the warp feature will regenerate and update based on the new curve shape. This enhancement will drastically improve your productivity and user experience. Enabling the selection of a target reference curve will allow you to capture your design intent with high precision.